Thanks, John. New tonight, this cell phone video shared with News for Jax captures a dramatic rescue on camera. This is a group of Jacksonville flag football players pulling a man to safety who drove his car into a pond at an Arlington Park. Tonight, we're hearing from several of those men who rushed in to help. We all jumped in the water and went in there after him. At that point, you know, what's going through your head? Save him. Honestly, just save him. And this video has gone viral, shared hundreds of thousands of times on social media. Yeah, the players are being praised for their quick thinking to help pull that man out alive. News for Jack's reporter Renee Beninati spoke with several of the men tonight. She's joining us live from Blue Cypress Park. Renee? Kent, these players were simply at the right place place at the right time. They were playing on a football field on the other side of the pond here when they heard about the crash. That's when they went running, thankfully pulling that man out of the water here. And tonight there are still tire marks from when the car was towed to land. Every Saturday, the Jacksonville Flag Football League plays here at Blue Cypress Park. Last weekend, their game quickly turned into a rescue. Sean Battles and Zach Thomas were on the field when this unfolded. Bring us back to this Saturday. Uh, when did you guys realize that something was wrong? It was around, I want to say about 2 p.m. Um, it was just a regular day. Uh, we were, he was playing we were, and I was refing the game. And then one of the guys uh, pointed over here saying that there was a car in there. We just yeah. sprung into action and wanted to get this man to safety. Gotta get him up. This white car with the driver still inside was quickly taking on water in the middle of the pond. Hey, you gotta get out, Cell phone video capturing the moments after several players jumped in and pushed the car closer to land. Justin Johnson and Abrion Brown rushed with their teammates and opponents to help. At that point, you know, what's going through your head? Save them. Honestly, just save them. They couldn't pry the windows or doors open. That's when a man climbed through an opening in the trunk to help pull the driver out. He didn't want to come out. He had to hold that steering wheel. Mm -hmm. So we just was just sitting there fighting. I know he didn't want to go. He was telling us to let him go, but we just couldn't let that happen. Eventually pulling the man to safety until first responders arrived to the scene. We appreciate y'all. Let the firefighters do their job. One of the players says he has been in contact with the driver they saved here, family members of that man who said that he is expected to physically recover. All of the men that I talked to tonight just wanted to let the driver know that they are keeping him and his family in their thoughts and prayers. Reporting live in Arlington, Renee Beninati, Channel 4, the local station.